We always hope that um, there'll be stocks around if we need it and if our loved one needs it. Well, today is me putting that back. So I'm Carl, um, me and my um, husband Martin um, were uh, the first uh, in the UK, I believe, to um, donate um, blood together last year following the, um, the rule changes um, that allowed more people to be able to give blood. 12 months ago today um, was our first donation. Um, Martin's very first donation I had given uh, many years ago after you know first leaving school I mean, for Martin especially it was you know important to try and give something back. Martin um, had a dad um, that had leukemia and had lots of donations um, and um, a niece that also had leukemia totally unrelated but um, she had to have loads of um, you know transfusions. Yes. Martin couldn't believe how easy it was um, you know to give it's literally you know the the admin beforehand takes longer than the actual donation. You know, today um, I've given and it's taken five minutes, that's all, to actually um, do my donation. Staff are always really friendly. Um, you get to sit back in a nice comfy chair for five minutes while you're giving. Um, and then at the end of it, you get um, an ice drink and a bar of chocolate. We all want the blood, you know, to be there when we need it. It just takes 20, 30 minutes out of your day. It's just so easy. There's no reason not to give. Um, Martin is a bit of a, um, a needle phobe, um, but even he said, you know, it wasn't an issue whatsoever. You like to say, if you get the opportunity and, you know, go if you can, it's, uh, it's well worth it. And it, it's a nice feeling afterwards knowing that your donation is actually going to help someone.